what's going on guys shot clips here once again and today we see some crazy clips of the worst couples i can find now like always guys my favorite clip will be at the end but in this first one it is definitely the worst clip i have ever seen this woman decides to use this man on a date that's exactly what she is and this man was spot on just because she isn't exchanging her time with money and as such she's exchanging it for food it's no different if you want money in return just for you to do things to someone that's exactly what you are a street worker and this man did the exact right thing because women like this need to be put on the spot it just got me thinking why have they pickled every vegetable but not cucumbers? I think women's body count matters. No. no. What's your body count then? <laughs> gotcha, bitch. You don't need to know that. If it doesn't matter, why not say? Because, personal. If I asked you what her color your hair was, I guess you would Zero. My body count is zero. Is it? Yeah. Zero. Now, the reason she doesn't want to say what her number is is because she knows that number is tied to what her value is. And she doesn't want people being disappointed or ashamed of her, even though she claims that body count doesn't matter. Trust me, guys, it 100% matters, and you're better off not having a higher body count. <laughs> be a sign that what you're wearing to the gym is inappropriate i swear these women are so addicted to attention they're addicted to the attention they get which is why they wear these outfits to the gym and out in public and then they're addicted to the attention they get online posting pictures of them then they're addicted to the attention they get posting themselves as the victim because people are looking at them. Now, she'll claim she doesn't want the attention. However, she's the one recording with a tripod in the middle of a store while dressed up like this. Also, who do you think the people in the gym are? They're just normal people the same way in the store. What's the difference? But that's the thing. I don't date men that make money from social media. You already told me you don't date broke men out there in the back. <laughs> <laughs> that's bullshit. What if this guy's a construction worker, hard ass working dude? He's a Man no, works his ass off. No. The guy's working his ass off every day. You always date rich men. That's what you said. You always date rich men. Stop. Don't date broke men. I wouldn't date a broke man. Why not? Why wouldn't you date a broke because man? Because it's what if hard all out there in the streets. I need to be taken care of. Broke men are so better. They're so mean and they're insecure as fuck. Damn. They're so insecure. I, I, I can't, I'm a I can't have a broke guy. man. Like, no, there's a difference. Because in your no, world, no, no. what you consider a broke man would be like a firefighter. For no. instance, like a guy's a firefighter, you'd look and be like, hey, he's a broke man. You know what? Well, no, you're, but I'm saying, are you, just, are you basing it off of like this, right? Are you base it off of a guy who's gonna buy these necklaces and this fucking materialistic shit that don't even matter in life? Excuse me. What does the guy gotta make bare minimum for you then? A year. No, no. Try to be fucking nuts if you have this conversation about bare minimum for money. Money should, I, be, I'll, I don't should know. be about real life, real feelings, real no, fucking people. No, of course, of course. There's a problem to it. That makes a year? Yes. Yeah. Or you can say monthly, whatever you can. Monthly? Like a mil a month. Okay. Uh, a million a, a million a month somebody's gonna make. <laughs> <laughs> a million a month is easily one of the highest numbers I have ever heard of. And she clearly doesn't understand the difference between a broke man and a person who is successful. Because even if you're making 100k a month, you're still broke in her eyes. And the issue isn't about men being broke, and it's about her standards. They're incredibly high, and they just need to be lowered. Long distance life hack. I'm going to the line dancing bar right now, but my boyfriend's 3,000 miles away, so I don't want to dance with any other guys. So I'm wearing a fake engagement ring, and whenever somebody asks me to dance, I'm just going to say, I'm married, can't dance with you, go away. Now, to be honest, this is a pretty solid idea. A lot of people argue why she even have to go to the club, which I kind of do agree with. But I mean, this is not a horrible option either. Is it easier to be a man or a woman? It's definitely woman. easier to be a woman. Why do you say that? The bare minimum they have to do is cook, clean. Ideally, like if you have a man, like you should be paying the bills, all that. You I can get, I can make two hundred dollars in a day just because I'm a woman. Like, yeah, like those drinks woman, over there, we didn't buy it for that. Yeah, <laughs> like, as a woman, woman. men will pay for anything you <laughs> want if they if they think they're gonna get something in return. But we usually don't give nothing. In, so, not usually we don't give nothing in return, but they think they're gonna get something. I'm not gonna lie, these women are actually making a valid point. And you gotta appreciate their honesty. Yes, they are using men like they just claimed. They just got a free drink without doing anything to the guy. And sure, shame on them for doing that. But you can't hate the player, you gotta hate the game. Because it's a simpia men that are doing this for no reason. Have you hold this? Okay, and if we can have your name. My name is Jeremy. And how old are you, Jeremy? I'm 27. 27, okay, what do you do? So I just graduated law school, oh. so I just got hired for Dora Legal Services. Congratulations. Check me out. Okay, let's start here. If we can have your name and how old you are. My name is Fiana and I'm 34. And Fiana, why did you end up popping your balloon? 
Um, I really like your smile, Appreciate but it. I just felt the young vibes um, immediately, and then I'm not sure if I like it. Now, the only reason all these women pop their balloons is because the first girl did it initially. Women want what other women want, and women don't want what other women don't want. That's just the way women's psychology works. <laughs> any like high school or like college confessions so when i graduated i like graduated a and then after i graduated i like six people i went to high school with she belongs to the streets how long was the span maybe like one per week i'd much rather have her not state her body count than just say this online being super proud about it there's nothing happy or exciting about what you're saying there's men that still kind of push this narrative that like women with very high body count is a sub woman why do you think they still do that they say they do it because of the research on body count which yeah. shows that people with higher body counts are more likely to be unfaithful they're less likely to be satisfied in monogamous relationships more likely to get divorced you know there's a lot of negative correlations with body count and they say that it's because the research but then it's like the research shows the same effects in men now this may be an unpopular opinion but this is exactly why i'm not a full red pill youtuber and this is exactly also why i say that having a high body count as a man isn't a good thing either i think having a high body count in general men or women is absolutely stupid and you're better off just focusing on yourself and focusing on other skills and wasting your time trying to grow that body count yeah it can be anything you want me to be be quiet Cole. They refuse to acknowledge when they are being flirted with. Well, girl, you're so handsome. And they just go... They look so confused to the point where you're like, they obviously want nothing to do with me. That's okay. Won't do that again. And later you find out they liked you the whole time, so... <laughs> In my opinion, it seems like the man she gave a compliment to never really got a lot of compliments. And this is how majority of men would act. They just don't know how to respond. Or she just can't handle rejection the right way. Now, yes, I guess this is sad to see she's still an attractive woman, but due to her height, a lot of men are not going to be interested in that. However, the same goes for short dudes. This is literally a normal thing that happens to a bunch of short men. And just like they got to deal with it, this woman has to do the exact same. But that does wrap it up for you guys so much for watching. If you guys do more content just like this, please click the links you guys see at the top of the screen. It does help my channel a lot. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Peace.